another edition after a long absence of I think we called it whiskey tasting notes. Or no, tasting whiskey notes. It's been so long we don't remember. I know we don't called. remember, but so today we this has been sitting in our liquor cabinet for months. Um, so we're gonna start with this one, which is called the Proper Twelve. Okay, it's an Irish whiskey, I believe. Triple distilled Irish whiskey. And I won't read anymore because it, it'll give away some notes. So we're gonna try this, and if you remember our format, while she pours, because <laughs> she's the expert pourer, um, we sniff it to see if we can smell any specific notes, and then we taste it and see if we taste anything specific. And uh, then we compare ourselves to experts online to see how poorly we did or if we did pretty good. Sometimes it's comedy because we were really bad. Although sometimes you work for me. No. No? <laughs> no? I thought we were getting pretty, pretty good there. No, it's been a long time. That's, I know, it's been, we're out of practice. And we wanted to open something so we could actually drink it. And it's just been sitting there because I for, for bowed her for opening anything until we did this. <laughs> I know. I mean, We can't repeat the dialogue with the leprechaun usually. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't know. <coughs> you inhaled it again, didn't you? It smells good. It smells like lemongrass. I will say lemongrass is like. I will say lemon and honey. Yeah. It's and definitely pledged light. from the table. And pledged. <laughs> we turned this one. We just cleaned the table. <laughs> it still smells very light. So, all right. What, well, what, do you, what do you smell besides COVID? Clearly. I don't. <laughs> oh my God, I don't even remember what. You just smell. Does it remind you of anything when you smell it? Okay, I'll go with fruit cake. Lemon ricola. Butt, lemon butt cake. Yes, it's okay. It's definitely medicinal quality to this one. It is very light. Grass. Lemongrass, maybe? <laughs> what are our other options? Name some things that we normally taste. <laughs> it's what we would taste. No, it did they? What fruit is this? It seems like it's burns. I'm getting lemon, I'm getting wood, obviously. It's whatever barrel it's in. Um, you getting anything? I'm getting medicinal qualities. I'm not getting any of the band-aid. No, it's, it's not peaty at all. Is this a blended? Triple distilled flesh. I'm trying not to look because it's it has some flavors down there. I'm trying not to look at that. <laughs> We're supposed to smell with our mouth open, wasn't that true? Yeah, I did. Forgot you did. Oh. Well, nobody started snorting and coughing. She's like inhaling the whiskey. The cats are interested. You can't see them; they're off camera. A rainbow and a four leaf clover. There, is it sweet to you? Mm hmm. What kind of sweet? Well, I already said the honey part. Yeah. Oh, let's do another sweet. <laughs> mm. <laughs> if, I, if I'm getting, because I usually can taste vanilla really easily. 
I'm not really getting vanilla from this, but I'm getting that creaminess that comes with the sweetness of vanilla. Oh, good idea before I finish all of it. We're gonna put just a drip of, almost more than a drip of water. Let's see if that brings anything out. What does that do again? Somebody told us what it did. Do you? Oh, that's why I'm asking you. <laughs> it's supposed to it opens it up. Opens it up. Brings Some type of oil oil. Oil. It's the surface. I don't know. Sweeter. Definitely more sweet. I like it. It's very drinkable. Yeah. Sit around and drink this on a. I'm not getting the lemon after we have the water. I am getting more of the sweet, maybe more vanilla. And that's a cat, one of her cats howling in the background. If you can pick that up, I'm not getting care of that. It's okay. Um, I'm getting like a grainy taste, which is probably just whatever it's made of. Like wheat. It tastes wheat. like wheat bread. Wheat? It smells like, it tastes like wheat bread? It, 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 with water in that, it tastes like wheat. Uh, whatever grain it's made of. I don't know. I don't know what to say. One last bit. And then we have to look and see how long or how accurate we look. It's definitely smoother with the water. Let's, let's look, read what the label says. Unless, do you have anything to add before mm -hmm. I start putting stuff away? Ooh, okay, let's read the back first. Paying tribute to where it all began from the 2012. Our master distiller and I sound good for the blah 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 story. I'm not tasting notes. Come on. Enjoy the smooth and balanced whiskey, a fine blend of golden grain and full flavored malted barley. Sure, that's that's what it tastes like. Triple distilled and aged a minimum of three years in bourbon barrels. Interesting, I think. Proper number 12 offers hints of vanilla, honey, <laughs> uh, light sweetness, and toasted wood. A proper salute to all. So that's fun. Yeah. A smooth blend with hints of vanilla, honey, and toasted wood. So, my wheat was off, but we both got the vanilla and honey. It's just, they're very subtle, though, to me. What about? Yeah. 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 But let's look online and see if there's what the professionals say. We had to do some searching online until we found somebody that actually talked about the, the, the notes that they smelled and tasted. But check this out. On the nose, very floral with notes of straw, cut grass, and powder. You got, she got the grass. She had that right. It smelled hotter than I would expect from a 40% ABV whiskey. This was encouraging. Anyways, blah, blah, blah. I couldn't find any of the apple, caramel, or vanilla notes that I tend to associate with blended Irish whiskey. I did get a little vanilla. I didn't get those either. Okay. But, yeah. Interesting. Flavors. Green apple flavors immediately. I did not get that. So he just said... To the green apple flavor, but before it, he said he couldn't find any of the apple flavor. He's talking about the nose. Oh, the smell. Yeah, the nose. Okay. Yeah. Um, he also tasted toasted sunflower seeds and wet sticks. <laughs> um, it was earthy. I, yes, I will say that, but not peaty, though. Right. Um, this guy didn't like it. He's talking about downside. Oh. He's like, quality of a sweetness that seems inauthentic. Like aspartame. I don't I didn't think get that. No, no. Uh, or, I don't know. There was an emptiness to its flavor. I will say it's not as sweet as some of the whiskeys that I do like. Maybe that's maybe he likes a lot more sweet. I'm not sure. Finish. There's no real complexity once down. The finish, unlike the nose, is not particularly hot. Yeah, what it did smell a little bit spicier on the nose, I guess, than afterwards. Is that what they mean by hot? I guess. Even with diluting well now, I think diluting it for water and ice made it smoother, but it is he calls it an easy drinking or smooth based on these qualities. I would agree with that. He says he says he calls it passive and lacking, whereas someone else might call it easy drinking and smooth. Like, oh, I thought sorry. it was really I skipped ahead. easy to drink. <laughs> so that was a review, and I, clearly he I don't think he seemed to like that one. <laughs> I thought it was okay. Sure, it's not the best that we've had and tried, but I thought it was fine. It, it was yeah. definitely easy to drink. I'll yeah. be sipping on it. Yeah, that's a good sip and whiskey. Um, I think it, if you're looking for a season to drink it, it would be summer because it's light and airy. <laughs> and sure. tastes somewhat like grass, like mm -hmm. Tammy said. <laughs> so do we? what was our scale? Was it one out of five star? Or was it one to, one to five stars or was it one to ten I stars? I don't remember having a scale. 
I think we did. I think we started rating them like something like, what's the, what's on your computer in the background? Brian! <laughs> oh, it's for Brian! It's the for Brian! Yeah, her son is doing his student teaching and he's all handsome and adult looking. He probably drinks whiskey. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. He's been drinking. Okay, so one out of five stars, what would you give this? One out of five stars? What would you give this between one and oh. five stars? Sorry. <laughs> four. 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 I like it. Really? I would get. Don't give me that look. <laughs> I would give it, oh gosh, I don't know. I would give it between a two and a half and a three star. I'd do three. I'm, I'm feeling generous today. Okay. 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 Well, I'm a snob. You know I like single malt scotch. Single malt scotch so. But that was pretty good for an Irish whiskey. I did enjoy it. <laughs> what about you? I enjoy it. Ew. <laughs> All right, you guys. Thank you for joining us again. And... We promise not to let so much time go by before we make another whiskey video. All right. Okay. See you next time. Say bye. 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 Oh, if you like this, please smash like below, down below and subscribe if you haven't already. Smash. Do that again. <laughs> that was her Celine Dion impression. Celine Dion it. There you go. Celine Dion it. <laughs> All right. See you next time. Bye. Bye.